NHL history is filled with spectacular goals. And what a move! Oh my! Behind the net. He scores! Fake the dogs! And today we're looking at the best of the best. I've narrowed it down to 10 spots somehow. We're gonna get a lot of honorable mentions. And just to give you some insight, I'm not necessarily going for the most iconic goals of all time. Off the floor! So honorable mentions right away, since we won't be seeing Patrick Kane's secret snipe, Gretzky's 50th and 39 games, or, pun intended, the most iconic goal in NHL history. Behind the net, the status and the Instead, we're looking at the most dazzling goals, the ones that make your jaw drop in shock that the guy was actually able to pull that off. The goals of skill and showmanship. I'm also not going with incredible assists like McDavid going through Florida, Patrick Kane to Hossa, Zegras' unreal over the net goal, or my favorite Eric Carlson to Hoffman. This is goals only. Now this list is my own opinion, so prepare to disagree with my choices as your face forms into Vernon Fiddlers. Don't whine too hard at me in the comments, hold back those tears if you can. But also, get ready to see the greatest goals ever scored at the NHL level. These won't be all the honorable mentions, as you'll see more as we go deeper into the video when we look at similar looking goals but I definitely wanted to highlight some of the other standouts. Blake Coleman definitely has some nice goals. He's got two that he's pulled off with just one hand. So that close, Coleman leading in, one hand shot, he scores! Crosby has scored similarly, as has Mario Lemieux. Of course, I've got to mention Finneganov. And this goal by Richard Zednick has always been a favorite of mine. We've got the Taves walkthrough. And a sweet goal by Ovi. Joe, it's just the one-handed alley-oop to go over the left shoulder of the goalie. Peter Forsberg taking his sweet time while not being stopped at all. Forsberg still up with it. Forsberg stumbles, keeps it in, and here he goes. Forsberg walking in, tees it up, waves, takes a shot, scores! And a great goal from Hagman as well. And then we got the spinorama. Patrick Kane has this beautiful goal, but I think Malkins is a bit of a one-up on that. And on Fane, the shot he scores! And before we get into the list, I also wanted to include the Forsberg. No Forsberg goals made the list, Chicken. but I of course had to make mention of them. Tarasenko especially had an unreal goal come that way. All right, let's begin the countdown. For our 10th spot, I wanted to look at an NHL staple, the between the legs goal. Merrick Malik's classic shootout winner 100% deserves a nod here, but I do think it's been done better since. We've got Hurdle, we've got Barky, we've got McDavid who looks like he doesn't even have to try. We've got so many more great in between the legs goals, but for me, I wanted to give it to more of an absolute bomb snipe. So at number 10, I'm going with Matthew Kachuk. In the middle of the shot block, Kachuk scores! Matthew Kachuk, what a goal! And did he go between his legs on that yes, goal? Yes, he did, Tell absolutely he did. Me? For our ninth spot, I'm going with a goal that stands completely on its own. It's one that makes all the lists, it seems, and for good reason, here's Rick Nash. Rick Nash, Nash now tries to split the defense and walk in. Nice move, another nice move! Oh! He scores! For number eight, we're going with Mike Legg's Michigan move. This is such a wild thing to do in a game, especially when you consider the NHL level. Svechnikov broke barriers when he did it for the first time in an NHL game, but as much as that needs a nod, it's definitely not the cleanest Michigan that we've seen. You see it so much more nowadays, which is part of the reason it's only at number eight, but it seems like the Michigans we've seen have gotten cleaner and cleaner in more recent years. Uh, 
I definitely have to give the nod to Zegris for also going around Milano that one time. But for me, the best Michigan overall was Kent Johnson's. Kent Johnson, Lee, unable to get a stick on it. Look at that. Oh, it's the Michigan. The rain for the replay. Kent Johnson on a backhand. He doesn't do the wraparound. He goes for the Michigan. We see the Michigan replicated all the time, but I don't see people trying this next move, this iconic move. And I definitely feel that it's so worthy of a spot here in the top 10. Tip pass Bork and out of the zone by Baranek. Here goes Bure. Pavel Bure, shorthanded, breakaway, score! The speed at which Bure does this, it's just wild to me. I love this skate move. For number six, we're going with undressing the defender. I love the Lemieux goal that was part of his five goals in five ways game, which five goals in five ways might be the most impressive thing to have ever been done in NHL history. You have Lemieux toying with Bork. And of course we have to mention the classic Lemieux goal going through Sean Randall Chambers in the finals. In terms of being iconic, this would certainly make the top 10. However, it's been done better by someone else, uh, in my opinion, and twice over to poor David Leguan. And he tries to split the defense and does drag it around Leguan who lost the stick. Now he's in and Reed score! Spectacular goal! I know the Preds would go on to win the game and then the series, but still, for Bobby Ryan to do something like that and still in the playoffs, no less, is spectacular. Now what's our category? Yager goals? Sure, this, this guy had some of the best hockey skill of all time. Look at this bat out of the air while falling. But I'm gonna go with his 92 finals dangling here. Septon hangs on to it, and a good move. This next goal is just absolute magic. And when I say magic, I think there might be someone specific that might come to your mind. Pavel Datsuk is an absolute wizard with the puck, breaking ankles where he can. And there's no way you can go through a top 10 list without having this signature fake out goal. Feed Pavel Datsuk in the clear all alone. Oh, what a goal. Oh, put that in your highlight reel, Bank. He's done it in the shootout as well, but to do it in an actual NHL game, like, to me, that's easily worthy of being here on the list. At number three and number two, we have the, hey, let's go through everyone, goals. And here we've got the long Denny Savard goal. It's like an extended version of the Yager goal. Just, just so magnificent. His pass, knocked down by Savard. Gate through center, dragging the puck. Savard still has it, around Keegan, around low, shoot, scores! What a goal by Dennis Savard! Now, when we think of going through everyone, we usually think of Connor McDavid, especially against the Rangers. Rangers having trouble changing here. McDavid, beautiful move, in on Datsuk has had his moment as well. Through the middle. Keeps on going. That's right in. Oh, really stopped. The oh, but my personal favorite, which comes in at number two, is from Evgeny Malkin. With 31. Malkin galloping. Malkin to the goal. What puts this over the top for me is him going through Brett Clark's legs. His speed, to me, makes it more impressive than that of Denny Savard. And to me, I actually feel like it's just so deserving of the number two spot, just all around. It's just unbelievable. But, at number one... Sends to the corner. Grabbed by Witt. 
and dumped out. Now picked up by Ovechkin. Here he comes. Ovechkin trying to drag it through him there. Oh! He scored. Alexander Ovechkin when it looked like it was no longer possible. He still got it done. Holy jumping, you have got to be kidding me. There's no way I couldn't have this one at the end. I think we all knew this Ovi goal was coming. It's the ultimate never give up play as he twirls his stick like a magic wand and wills the puck into the net. So that'll do it for my list. I know there are many spectacular goals that may not have gotten a mention. Let me know which ones that didn't make the video should have been there. And also let me know what you think is the best NHL goal of all time. Even give me your top 10 if you want to. Have a good one.